Because Connor and I are tying the knot quite soon, let's make some pretzels with Adrian Stutz of the YouTube channel XOXO Cooks. Hi. Hi. We've collaborated before and I'm so stoked to collab with you again. Me too. Thanks for having me. Let's make some pretzels. Let's make some pretzels. Have you ever made pretzels before? I haven't and when you suggested it, she said, hey, let's make pretzels. And I said, that seems too hard. I don't want to. <laughs> But we are anyway, and I'm excited. But we are. We found a super easy recipe. It's Alton Brown's recipe. Um, it looks really doable, and I think that us pretzel newbies could probably become pretzel pros. I think so, too. Here's what you'll do. In the bowl of a stand mixer, add one tablespoon of sugar and two teaspoons of kosher salt. Add one and a half cups of warm water, then sprinkle one package of active dry yeast on top. Let it sit for about five minutes until the mixture begins to foam. Then add four and a half cups of flour. Alton Brown suggests using all-purpose flour. I did half all-purpose flour and half whole wheat pastry flour. Add two ounces of unsalted butter, melted. Using the dough hook attachment, mix it on a low speed until it's well combined. Knead the dough for four to five minutes. Remove the dough from the bowl, clean the bowl, and oil it with vegetable oil. Then put the dough back in and cover with plastic wrap. Let it sit for about 50 minutes. And while you're waiting, hang out with your friend. So since we're making pretzels to signify tying the knot, Adrian is a married woman. And bling, 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 bling. Is that what you say on YouTube? What are your pieces of, I was gonna say pretzel advice. <laughs> what is your piece of wedding advice for me if you had to tell me one thing to keep in mind? Well, and I feel like if you look up wedding advice, you're gonna get lists of like a hundred tips. Like there's so much garbage out there. I have Googled magazines. it. I've Googled yeah, it. Yeah, just forget all of those things because the one tip that I just tell everyone when they get engaged is don't listen to anybody else's tips. So take the stress off. Enjoy it. Just eat pretzels. We just eat pretzels. <laughs> uh, pretzels? Uh, yeah, okay. Preheat the oven to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Put parchment paper on two oven-proof sheets and lightly brush with vegetable oil. Set that aside. Add 2 thirds cup baking soda to 10 cups of water in a big saucepan. Bring that to a rolling boil. While that's heating up- Oh, that, that rose nicely. It feels nice. Yeah, it does. Separate the dough into smaller pieces and begin to roll it into a rope. Make a U-shape with the rope holding the ends of the rope Cross them over each other, and again, and press into the bottom of the U. It's a pretzel. Here, let me show you those steps again. Now you'll want to place your pretzels in the boiling water, one by one, for 30 seconds each. Remove them from the water and put them back on the oiled parchment paper. Make your egg wash. Take one large egg yolk and beat it with about a tablespoon of water. And then brush the top of each pretzel with your egg wash. And sprinkle with salt. We're using kosher salt. Bake until they're a dark golden brown color, about 12 minutes. Let cool and enjoy. They, they really turned out so so well. They're I'm impressive. Very, it's really easy. I'm very proud of us. I was scared for no reason. Thank you for pushing me beyond my comfort zone. You know what? That's what I'm here for. It tastes like a pretzel. They're really good. Mm -hmm. How about some Dijon? Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, you gotta have mustard on these. Oh, yeah. Oh, big Way better. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm -mm. These are so good. <laughs> these are great. So, Adrian, tell them a little bit about your channel. My channel is XOXO Cooks, and I do weekly videos. Oh, we didn't even talk about what we made on your channel. Oh, yeah, P.S. We talked even more in depth about wedding stuff and just how to have a positive attitude about it. And we made little cute love tea sandwiches. It's perfect for Valentine's Day. I love them. And life. So, yes. go to her channel, check it out. I'll put the link up, like, here somewhere. Thank you for coming on my channel. Thanks for having me. And for being such a pretzel princess. Oh, we're pretzel princesses together yes. in our pretzel palace. <laughs> yes. Don't forget to keep it quirky. Yeah. With pretzels.